Okay. Okay, so today we're doing a, uh, a loft clearance of all the insulation and we're also going to be treating it all with biocide to get rid of any scent trails and things like that which could attract uh, rats back in in the future. Um, if you've read our write up on this, which should be attached to this video hopefully, um, you'll remember me talking about the, how they always use the same routes. And here's quite a good example. You can see the dirty trail going along here and along there and along this way, and it's all full of droppings and urine. And every time they go down a route, they'll leave these trails with the urine smell. So they can find them in the pitch black and obviously without the light up here it's absolute pitch black in here but to a rat that's not a problem the pond in here is quite bad um let's see what it looks like when we're finished there's a bit of a pond around here to say the least so let's have a look gotta get the other side up rick yeah. ah. There it is. One very dead rat. Can imagine how much that would have smelt in a few weeks. Oh my god. And then it would have putrefied. All the maggots would have eaten it. You'd have had flies. And then the putrefied blood would start coming through all your plasterboard. So we'll get rid of that one as well then. Lovely job this, isn't it? Okay. okay. You might remember as well. I was talking about what we call latrine points where basically all the rats and their friends all go and do their poos in one special place and so sometimes there won't be any droppings anywhere for you to see because they'll all be hidden away it seems this rat infestation they were a bit confused um, because as you can see there's droppings left right and center now if you look here you can see what we call a latrine point starting to build up where that will just get bigger and bigger and bigger so, looks like this was used. <coughs> yeah, lovely. Okay. Okay, as you can see, for a lot of hard graft, we've got all the uh, the insulation out, the contaminated insulation. And as you can see, all the droppings underneath still yet to come up. So we're going to spend the next bit of time hoovering away. Okay, so as you can see, absolutely immaculate now, no more droppings, all the insulation's gone, all the dust has gone. So all we've got to do now is use this special biocide, which basically kills viruses, uh, bacteria, fungus, you name it. But it needs to get pretty much everywhere now to kill any of those scent trails, because we don't want any other rats in the future coming past, picking up the old scent trails. Uh, and coming back in and infesting. So very important you get it everywhere. And use the proper tools. You can actually see all the old urine stains, look. All of those, that's the salt out of the urine. Massive one over there. Horrible. Oh, 